guys it's me lexi welcome back to my channel today's video i'm going to be doing my sunday reset so i'm actually about to get ready for the day to start off my little sunday reset i am getting my nails done i've had these nails since i went on vacation and they're definitely grown out girl so at 10 o'clock i have a nail appointment with my mom so i'm about to like get in the shower and get ready for that i think i'm gonna wash my hair though because y'all my hair needs to wash so bad if i'm gonna be getting into a sunday reset which means cleaning up my stanky room i definitely have some homework to do that i have not done yet so i will also be doing that today in this video thank you bloom for sponsoring today's video after taking a shower, I enjoy a drink of water with my Bloom Greens. This is the ultimate daily gut health supplement made with so many organic fruits and veggies, probiotics, antioxidants, and more. They balance gut health, clear your skin, and boost your energy. So check out Bloom at the link in my description. All right, guys, we made it to the nail salon. Bro, when I wash my hair and I let it dry in the car, it doesn't dry right it looks good. appointment complete i am definitely going to show you guys like my toes and stuff when i get home but i'm really really happy with this i redid the white that i got last time except i didn't get that chrome on top so yeah now they're just white and i love them so i'm gonna go home now i'm gonna show you all my toes and stuff later but we gotta get on with the rest of the sunday reset because i got a lot of stuff to do here are my toes <laughs> And then, like I said for my nails, I went with that white, except I didn't get the grandma pearl on top. I just left it regular. So yeah, I'm really happy with it. I like it. Yeah, they're very simple. They're short. I didn't break one single nail the last time I got my nails done, and I got this basically the same set. But for this set, I asked him for like the same length and everything, so I'm really happy with that. Anyways, now that I'm at home, I'm gonna get started with my Sunday reset, but I need to make a to-do list. So I created a little list for my Sunday reset and I added it to my Notion just so like it can all be together. Here is my little Sunday reset. Let's get started. always starting my laundry if i don't start my laundry then <laughs> i'm gonna be here all day yeah no i start my laundry and let that go then i can just the laundry will do itself i can focus on other things like my closet i don't know if i want to look at that so i'm gonna go ahead now and move on to my bedroom i'm gonna clean up my bedroom and try to get it back looking good i mean i'm not gonna try i'm just gonna clean it this is gonna be so easy to clean it's not that bad so this is gonna take like five seconds first step when cleaning your room is pick up all the trash and make a trash pile. Um, yeah. Next step is to pick up all the clothes and sort them out if they're clean or dirty, put them where they go. I 
literally those two steps will take your room a long way. Like my room looks 10 times better. What's next to tackle is over here. This is my makeup station, but I also brought this plant in here, which I don't know if I'm gonna keep it in here because it's just on my desk. I also have a bunch of cords, so I need to do some cord management. I don't know why I have so many cords right here. Okay. looking so much better in here like this is why sunday resets are important because if i didn't do just this one little cleanup in my room my room would have gone on to look so bad and it would have just gotten worse as the week went on so this is so important for me because this is how i make sure to start off the week the right way if i don't do this it's just gonna set me back even further so this is what it's looking like so far it's not perfectly clean i have to fold all these towels except the reason why i haven't folded them is because i have nowhere to put them right now this looks awful and i need to clean it up so i'm just gonna get rid of of half of this and then like clean my whole bathroom because my bathroom it needs a little cleanup too just like a refresh i deeply cleaned my bathroom and everything last weekend it's not gonna be as rough and tough as a clean <laughs> and folded before I can put them away. I need to really do something with this cause yeah, no. Now that my shelves are finally organized, they look so much better. I have to get the rest of my bathroom looking that good. So I'm gonna go ahead and clean it all up.
Okay, so I just switched my laundry over. So once that's done drying, I'll be able to put my sheets back on my bed and finish up with my room because literally my room is like pretty much so clean. I'm so happy about my bathroom. Yes, period. This shelf finally looks decent and I cleaned my actual tub. Honestly, you guys, if you keep up with cleaning once a week, it will not get too bad. Normally, when I'm doing my Sunday reset, it has been weeks of just letting it get really just dirty and messy and I'm not good at just cleaning every every week or every days or putting stuff back or anything that has to do with being organized it's just not over here okay i think now what i'm gonna do i might head over to the post office and see if i have any mail in there i was gonna just take a break from cleaning and check my post office box because i have a p.o box if you didn't know here is my p.o box address and if you want to send me anything you definitely can i check it all the time and i open my mail all the time and every now and then a subscriber sends me something really cute like i got some really cute nails from one of you guys before those were so adorable so so shout out to anybody who's ever sent me anything in my P.O. box. But yeah, I'm gonna go check it. And then when I get back, I am almost done. I have to do the kitchen, which I'm kind of dreading because one, I hate doing the kitchen. But honestly, it's not gonna take that long. Cleaning the kitchen doesn't even take long for real. It's just yesterday I cooked steak and mashed potatoes and yeah, I didn't clean up. I didn't do the dishes last night. I just ate and like crashed. I have a lot of nasty, dirty, stinky smelling dishes to do, but they cannot stay in my sink because then they'll literally stink so bad. So I have to do that as soon as I get back. But real quick, I'm gonna just go check my PO box, go for a little drive and see if I have anything. I love when I actually get something in the P.O. box because it's like a little gift, not like to open, like the surprise just for me. <laughs> Let's open this up, see what it is. Oh, it's kind of open. Ah! <gasps> no, this is cute. I think somebody sent me some bracelets. Y'all know I make bracelets all the time. Like I wear them all the time. This is so all right, so it looks like I got some bracelets. Let's see who the shop is. Um, Michaela Janae, K Sinclair. Ooh, period. So these bracelets are from K Sinclair. You guys can support her. Thank you, girly. Ooh, okay, so I think this is like a stacked bracelet. Got these two. These are also super cute. Thank you, girl. Ooh, and then I got another one. Ooh, look at this one. This one's like a charm. No way, girl. Oh, then I got this charm bracelet. It's got some charms on it. This is so cute. Thank you, girl. I'm about to wear these right now. Cute. Okay, so now I got pretty wrist. Thank you, Kate Sinclair. And if you want to send me anything to be in my video, if you have a small business, here goes my little, yeah. All right, guys, I decided to get some boba and some um, sushi from this sushi place. <laughs> Can I just get a California roll with spicy mayo and eel sauce and then a caramel milk tea boba? Oh guys, I'm about to feast. I'm gonna eat it right here, right now because I know when I get back to my house, I'm gonna have to like, you know, really clean up because I have to do the kitchen and everything and then my homework. I got some movie tickets to see a movie with my boyfriend today. Mmm, perfect. Ooh. This is what I got, you guys. I got some sushi. Look at that. Mmm. I always get it with spicy mayo and eel sauce just because it's so good. Anyways, I'm gonna have to work on my homework like after the movie because I won't have time to do it before. But also, like, I want to do my homework when everything else is done, my house stuff is done. But honestly, I'm so close to being done with that, so I'm not even tripping. It's the only thing is, I have classes tomorrow that I have not been to yet in person, and tomorrow will be like the first time I'm actually going to my Monday Wednesday classes. So I'm a little nervous just because like I've been gone. Like I hope I didn't miss anything too much. So hopefully, I'm not too far behind. 
Also, bruh, I was planning out my week this morning with my sister and I realized that I have to film basically every single day this week, which I am not mentally prepared for. So I need to mentally prepare for that and like plan all these videos out and make sure that I have that like all in my head. Cause the moment I forget and slack, everything's going down. Ooh, everything's going downhill. So I just gotta stay on my P's and Q's, but I can't do that if I don't have a day like this. So I'm grateful for the weekend y'all. Let's get back to it, get back to the cleaning. That was a great little lunch break though. So I'm about to head home, get back to it y'all before my movie that in less than an hour. So my kitchen's not fully clean, but I did get the dishes into the sink. However, it's time to go take a break and watch a movie. So I'm excited. I will get back to everything when I get back. I'm not gonna just, you know, slack off. I promise because I still have to wipe the counters down and then fill the sink with Fabuloso, clean the sink, clean my stove and then vacuum sweep and all that good stuff. Also, I gotta put the sheets back on my bed. And yes, but I'm gonna just go to this movie really quick cause I'm excited. The movie we're seeing is Talk To Me. I'm excited to see it. guys my kitchen is all clean it looks good my favorite thing about having a clean kitchen is lighting a candle after and this scent sweet cinnamon pumpkin is so good it smells amazing it smells like fall now that my kitchen is done i'm gonna move on to the living room and the living room is honestly not even too bad i just gotta straighten all this up i have this on my couch right now to protect my couch from any spills normally i have a couch cover on it but i gave it to my mom to wash and treat for me because i accidentally spilled high sea fruit punch on it which this is exactly why i need like something over my couch at all times because like you just never know with me so as you can see i'll be i'll be munching on the couch and i'm not gonna stop. I'm just gonna, you know, try to protect it. Just ignore this. This is my protection for now. It's just a blanket. But mom, I know you're watching this video. Can I have my couch cover today? <laughs> living room clean kitchen 
clean. Now I just need to kind of focus on this area and then finish up my bedroom because my sheets are all washed. I just have to put them on my bed, make them look all good. I'm gonna put some fresh sheets on your bed if you're not like washing your sheets like once a week maybe maybe once every two weeks girl i'll let you go that far you have to wash your sheets y'all that's thank you It's so perfect right now. And now all I have to do is do my homework and then I'm good, y'all. The Sunday is reset and I'm ready for the new week. So last thing on the to-do list, let's get this out the way. I'm loving my room. I feel like I'm gonna have a perfect start to the week and a clean start. So let's go get this homework done before um the due date passes. For my homework, I only have work due in one of my classes, and it's my online class. And these online teachers, like, they don't play. Like, they make you turn in homework every week. So I have a 200-word discussion due, and the availability for it ends tonight. I low-key have been putting it off all week, but I still have some time to get it done. So I'm going to just do this because I'm not trying to lose any points. Like, we too early into the school year to be playing. I am gonna go through my D2L and see if I have any homework for any other classes. I just did a quiz for another class, but it was just one of those like syllabus quizzes that are like easy. But I'm just gonna go through and check the rest of my courses. One of my courses is self-defense, so like I don't have any homework in that class. One thing I am worried about is this Spanish course because they ended up dropping me from Spanish when I was trying to switch my course from Spanish to public speaking because that is something I really wanted to take this semester, but I forgot to enroll until like three days before school started. So that class was full anyways. Then on the website it said they weren't full. It wasn't full. So I tried to enroll and they ended up just dropping me out of Spanish and not putting me into any other class because it got full. So I'm gonna just do this Bible work and then I'll be done for the whole day. I'm pretty much done with this little assignment. I just have to turn it in and then I'm good to go. So I'm done with my homework. Thank you, God. Thank you, because for real, I'm really glad I just got this out the way because I do not want to miss any homework. Like I'm really trying to be on my P's and Q's and A's and B's. So yeah, I am so tired. So I'm gonna get ready for bed now. I'm so happy though that I got my homework done. Like that was the main thing I wanted to do today. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's Sunday reset. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up and don't forget to hit the subscribe button for more content. I love you guys and I'll see you in the next one.